Hi there. Northerly winds stay with us for the next couple of days and overnight as showers begin to ease and clear spells become more prevalent, it's going to turn rather chilly in places. Still though, there will be further showers arriving into the north and the east through the night and some patchy cloud and showers continuing elsewhere. Northern Ireland, for example, parts of Wales, northwest England, but many of the showers will tend to fade away or become restricted to coast overnight and as a result, clear spells will become much more commonplace. Under those clear skies, seven or eight Celsius widely, but in some sheltered spots, we could see three or four Celsius. And as a result, a grass frost is possible first thing Tuesday. But despite the chill in the air, actually there'll be plenty of sunshine around first thing, particularly for southern England through the Midlands, parts of Wales, Northern Ireland, for example. Further showers will develop through the morning. And once again, just about anywhere could be affected by a shower or two into the afternoon. However, most of the showers will by the afternoon affect northern, central and eastern England. The odd heavy downpour here as well. And it's going to feel particularly cool in the north and the east on the coast, 12 to 13 Celsius at best. Towards the southwest, fewer showers, a better chance of some sunny spells coming through. Of course, out of the wind at this time of year, the sun is strong, so moderate to high UV levels. And temperatures of 17 or 18 Celsius out of the breeze won't feel too unpleasant. But that breeze certainly is on the cool side. It come, comes all the way from the Arctic and it will continue into Tuesday night as well, particularly towards the north and the east. Lighter winds in general elsewhere and more prevalent clear skies. So as a result, I think Wednesday is going to start off fairly chilly as well, with temperatures widely in the single figures. But plenty of sunshine on Wednesday morning, particularly for Northern Ireland, parts of Scotland, Wales, Western England. And this ridge of high pressure is going to settle things down only for about 24 hours or so on Wednesday before this area of low pressure swings the next frontal system in from the west for Thursday, followed by showers as we end the week. There will be some showers on Wednesday. East Midlands into East Anglia, the southeast of England, the odd heavy downpour. But for many, those showers will be easing. Some thicker cloud and some more prolonged rain there for Orkney, the far northeast of Scotland, a cool breeze continuing. But otherwise, Wednesday, away from those showery parts of eastern UK, Wednesday is going to be a fine day with uh, sunny spells in the west, but once again, temperatures below par for the time of year, 15 to 18 Celsius in the southwest, 12 to 13 in the northeast. Then after the rain goes through on Thursday, it's a showery outlook for Friday and into the weekend, some heavy downpours out there, but also some sunshine and temperatures will begin to recover a little.